So I'm on barchart.com. I've already searched for NVIDIA while Patrick was talking. And so I wanted to literally show the audience what we're talking about uh, with this whole PE ratio and PEG ratio stuff. I'm going to blow this up a bit. Mm -hmm. And so where I went to or came to on barchart.com is called Price Overview. And when you look at shows of ours, past shows, you see that we use bar chart quite a bit. Um, so when you hit the price overview option, it gives you kind of the analysis of the company and its price action. And right here, price to earnings, right here. Here is the PE ratio. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is the PE ratio for the TTM, the 12 month, what is that? The the that, that's the trailing, trailing 12, months. 12 so, months so the last right. pre the last 12 months right the trailing 12 months so this gives you the pe ratio right here right okay? yes here is the earnings per share for nvidia right right mm -hmm. here eight dollars and 14 cent earnings per share so so we have the pe ratio right here we mm -hmm. have the earnings per share right there so looking at the pe ratio one would say um is this price right here expensive for nvidia so like we said before nvidia price literal price is equal to the earnings per share this right here this is what the stock price actually should cost. It should cost $8 for uh, per share. That The price of NVIDIA literally should be eight, but you multiply that times the PE ratio and jack it up to 599. So if you, if you were to multiply this by this, you should get approximately that number for those who want to do a quick calculation uh, with the calculator. So uh, so that's how price of stocks are determined. But how do you know that this is a good price? The, P, the PEG ratio gives you that. So uh, general speaking, you should not pay much more than the growth rate of the company. So if you're paying more than twice the growth rate of the company, then you are paying too much for the stock. The stock is a little inflated and that's where you have to be a little careful. So what is what I just said, what does that mean? That means I should go down here and look at what is the projected growth rate for NVIDIA? So look at the growth rate for NVIDIA. Over the past year, year over year compared to its past quarter, it grew 77%. Hey, guess what? Look at this PE ratio. So essentially, if your company is growing 77% and your PE ratio is 77%, you actually are okay because people are willing to pay the growth rate times its earnings to come up with a equal, a, a equitable share price. So, so I just wanted to show that. So let's look at something in particular. Let's just look at some more interesting facts.